Acute sinusitis is an acute infection of the paranasal sinuses and it may lead to complications with attendant morbidity and mortality. So early recognition of this clinical condition is mandatory. Swimming in dead waters, dental infection or dental extraction, um, fractures involving the sinuses, nasal obstruction from polyps and allergic rhinitis are predisposing factors to developing acute sinusitis. And the causes are viral, um, common cold, bacterial, um, group A, hemolytic, strepto, cocci, infections, and also um, S, pneumonia, staphylococcus aureus, hemophilus influenza, M, um, catar, um, catalysis, and also allergy. The symptoms are cough, nasal congestion, pressure in the face and the head, frontal headaches, and post nasal drip. The signs that are usually elicited are um, yellow or green, um, thick nasal discharge, which may be foul smelling, also halitosis, persistent fever, tenderness above and below the eyes. When patient bends over or when um, these areas are tapped lightly. Investigations are FBC, X-ray of paranasal sinuses. The treatment objectives are to reduce symptoms of pain and fever, to eradicate infection, to encourage um, drainage of sinuses, non-pharmacological treatment, adequate hydration, um, steam inhalation, tooth extraction under antibiotic cover, that's if dental focus of infection is present. Pharmacological treatment for um, treatment of bacterial infection, first line treatment, give amoxicillin oral in adults 500 milligrams 8 hourly for 10 days. In children 6 to 12 years, give 250 milligrams 8 hourly for 10 days. 1 to 5 years, give 125 milligrams 8 hourly for 10 days. Less than 1 year, give 62.5 milligrams 8 hourly for 10 days. Or you can give amoxicillin clavulanic acid oral. In adults, 1 gram 12 hourly for 7 days. In children more than, more than 12 years, you give 1 500, 1 to 5 milligrams tablets 12 hourly for 10 days. And 6 to 12 years, you give 5 milliliters of 457 milligrams suspension 12 hourly for 10 days. 1 to 6 years, you give 5 milliliters of 200. 28 point and um, 5 milligram suspension 12 hourly for 10 days and one month to one year give 2.5 milliliters of 228.5 milligram suspension 12 hourly those doubled in severe infection the so two weeks to one month you give 1.25 um, milliliters of 228.5 milligram suspension 12 hourly and those doubled in severe infection the second line treatment to give um so oral in adults 200, 250 to 500 milligrams 12 hourly for five to seven days in children three months to 12 years give 125 milligrams 12 hourly double in severe infection for treatment of bacterial infection in patients with penicillin allergy you give erythromycin oral um adults 500 milligrams six hourly for 10 days in children 2 to 8 years if 250 milligrams 6 hourly for 10 days and one month to two years i'm 125 milligrams 6 hourly for 10 days new needs um 12.5 um, milligrams per kilogram 6 hourly or azithromycin oral In adults, 500 milligrams daily for five days, and in children, 10 milligrams per kilogram daily for five days. For pain relief, um, you give paracetamol oral to relieve pain if present. In adults, 500 milligrams to one gram, six to eight hourly. In children, six to 12 years, you give 250 milligrams, um, six to eight hourly. And one to five years, give 120 to 250 milligrams, six to eight hourly. And three months to one year, give 60 to 120 milligrams, six to eight hourly. For nasal decongestion, give um, ephedrine nasal drops 
and adults one percent one to two drops into each nostril up to four times daily when up when required in children 0.5 percent as one to two drops into each nostril up to four times daily when required or neomycin 0.5 percent um hydrocortisone 1.5 percent nasal drops in adults two drops 12 hours in children one drop 12 hours so referral criteria you refer all cases which do not improve after one week of treatment to the ENT specialist